Hi there, uh, welcome to another episode of Luke's Garage. Uh, today what we're going to be doing is uh, talking about brakes. Now, many people will say the Bonnevilles are pretty underprepared for their, I don't know, they always say the suspension's pretty shocking and pretty shitty. Uh, they say the brakes aren't great. Personally, I mean, I've not had any bad experience with it, but I would say the front brakes could be a little bit better. And I reckon it was about two years ago I stuck off stuck some double H sintered pads by EBC onto my front brake and they were pretty good to be fair. Um, I can't really fault them. Uh, but I was reading up the other day and I read that you can change the standard caliper from a, uh, a two pot caliper, which is what we've got on there at the moment, for a three pot one. There's quite a few brands that sell these for about uh, three to 500 quid. They sell them along with things like floating discs and a few other bits and pieces. Uh, but I really wanted to try and get some sorry, better performance uh, without shelling out you know, 500 quid. I mean, spend another 600, spend a thousand pounds, probably get a whole new front end. But to be honest, I don't see the point in doing that because then you're not gonna be uh, riding a Bonneville, are you? You're riding a, probably a Yamaha. Now, the caliper in question, I mean, it's a standard Nissan one on there, it's two pot. It's um, pretty straightforward. I found out the replacement you can get, the free pot, is actually from a Honda Hornet or CB500, I think it is. It's a free pot Nissan caliper. And you can see you've got the two mounting holes here and here, and they match the ones here and here. So essentially, it should be a, a direct replacement. This is a left hand side caliper, um, as you can see, and it cost me £40 delivered off eBay. I also purchased a brand spanking new set. A double H sintered pads from EBC to stick on there. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to lob off my old brake caliper, I'm going to stick on the new one and um, probably give it a go. At the same time I've gone through the process of um, upgrading to my hydraulic clutch and I'm going to change the brake lines for um, what are they called? I've completely forgotten haven't I? Braided lines, that's the one. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to change them from braided lines. At the moment, I've already taken off the um, previous one. Um, so we're going to see what it's like. But essentially, you can replace your caliper, you can add braided lines, you can upgrade the brakes, pads themselves, all that for 80 quid. And that sounds a lot better than spending five to six hundred pound on a three pot caliper from somewhere else. Your thoughts. Thanks for watching, guys.